What's up guys, Iovo here, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make your very own Minecraft profile picture for absolutely free without using Cinema 4D or Photoshop, so if you guys do enjoy this tutorial, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, and with that being said, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up your browser and go to minecraft.novaskin.me, and this page should open up. Now the first thing you do when you make a profile picture is to get your avatar loaded up, so here on the left side you can click on gallery and browse through a bunch of different skins you can use. So for example, maybe I like this guy over here, I can click on it and bam, it should load up, there we go. You can also search for different skins and your IGN in the search bar. So for example, I can search for Sky is Minecraft maybe. Let's just type that out. And a bunch of skins opened up that I could use. So maybe I could use this one if I like it. And finally, what you can also do is open up your own skin by clicking open over here and loading the file. Now once you have your base skin done, you can also make changes to this skin to customize it a bit. So down here what you can do is use the pen tool and actually draw over the skin like you would in a skin editor. So for example, I can just, you know, maybe add some dots and stuff. I can change the color, maybe oh, I want to give it like a yellow smile. I could do that, isn't that pretty? But yeah, you can just use these tools and over here you can change the color palette as well and find colors you like and customize it to how you see fit. Now I don't like these changes, so I'm just going to press Ctrl Z to get rid of them. And there we go. Now once you've added your little changes to the skin, you can also add some clothing to your guy, which is also known as wear. So you can just click on the wear tab over here and also give it some additional clothing. So for example, I like this jacket that this guy made, so I can click on it and it's going to add it to my guy. Now once your guy has been completely you know, customized and made and you're happy with the way they look, you want to give it a certain pose because right now it looks boring just standing there so you want to click on the pose tab. Now here most of it is self-explanatory you can give it a random pose or these set poses over here by clicking on them. So for example maybe I like this pose which is called walk to I'm just going to click on it and now my guy is walking I could pan around like that and that looks pretty cool. I can also give it a pickaxe maybe in this case, I wanted to hold it on the right hand, so I'm going to click on hold right. And you can actually choose what you want it to hold, so I'm going to give it a diamond sword. And there we go, this badass is holding a diamond sword now. And he's in this like attack position. Now if I wanted to change it a bit more, I could adjust the sliders over here. So if I wanted to move the left arm back more, I could just drag it further. And I'm guessing this is the elbow, oh this is the tilt, okay so yeah. Just mess around with the sliders, because they don't really specify which each one does, but uh... Just position it to how you see fits best, so I can even move the body a bit and have it face so that it's kind of diagonal. And yeah, just play around with that and see what you like. And the final thing you have to do is just add a background to the profile picture. So you want to just click on the background tab and you can choose a file for your background. Um, there should be some backgrounds opening up as well, but they're not opening up. But yeah, you can just click on these and see what background you like. So for example... Hmm, yeah, they're not opening up right now, so we're just going to choose a file. Oh, we'll just use our Zyovo purple background. That looks pretty cool. Oh, now we're just going to zoom in a bit. And just position it, so I think that looks good. And there we go, my profile picture is now complete. Now once you've made your guy, you've set the pose you like, and you have the background of your choice. The final thing we have to do is actually save the profile picture. Now unfortunately, when you click on the photo button, you can save it, but it won't have the background. So what you could do is save it and then put it into a post editor like Photoshop, remove the white background and put it in a background of your choice. But if you don't have Photoshop, what you can actually do is just use a screen cap software like maybe Gaiazo, and then you know, hold shift and take a square screenshot like so, and then have it open up in a new tab and then just save that image and make that your profile picture. But yeah, that's about it for this tutorial guys. Hopefully this helped you make your profile picture. If it did, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching. My name is Iovo, and I'm signing out.